please do not do this at home. Not that this is very dangerous, but it may break your heart. Yeah, it, it still hurts, I must say. It still hurts. But for the sake of science and technology, and our completely arbitrary, non-scientific experiment, we searched for what it takes to completely bust a Sennheiser Evolution 935 microphone. And we succeeded. And we succeeded. And this is what's left of it. The Evolution 935 is a cardioid vocal stage microphone specially designed to perform under pressure while cutting through the mix with its high output. It is made for the working musician on stage. Excellent sound results guaranteed, 365 days a year. The Evolution 935 is extremely robust to live a tough life on the road. Extremely robust. That's what the manual says. But how tough can it get? That is what we wanted to find out. As a first step, we try to drop it. We try to throw it to the ground. And we try to throw it up in the air. Hello, hello, testing, testing. Hello, hello, testing, testing. But soon it was clear to us that we had to take this to a higher level. So we took it outside. For visual reasons, we gave the Evolution 935 a Sennheiser blue flag. And then we threw it out of the window. Curious about how it survived, we found out that the XLR connection got bent because of the impact. So we had to more or less hammer it back into its original shape. Hello, hello, testing, testing. Hello, hello, testing, testing. All right. Next, we tried to step on it. We tried to jump on it, but since that didn't do anything, we tried to run it over with a car, with our van, actually. But um, that didn't do any harm either. Hello, hello. Testing, testing. We tried to drill it. We tried to file it. We did all kinds of things that one should not do to a vocal microphone. We even used it as a hammer. The basket didn't really like it, but we were able to actually put some nails into a wooden board with it. Hello, hello, testing, testing, hello, hello, testing, testing. It was only when the sledgehammer came out that there were casualties. And we are aware of the fact this is an extremely cruel thing to do to a microphone. And so we apologize for the disturbing footage we're about to show you. The thing is, a vocal microphone is not designed and should not have to deal with sledgehammers during its life. So do not try this at home. And if, if you do, please be very careful not to get your heart broken because watching a perfectly fine and great microphone like the Evolution 935 being smashed to pieces for the sake of an experiment is a very sad thing to behold. If you're looking for the industry standard when it comes to wired cardioid vocal microphones, a microphone that deals with pretty much anything apart from a sledgehammer. A microphone that picks up great sound with a focus for your voice and nothing but your voice. The Sennheiser Evolution 935 is the microphone you want to check out. Hello, hello. Testing, testing. Nah. 
It's officially dead. 